So I'm a little bit confused because the uh, that scenario there is King Coaster's Royal Decree, which I need to be level five to unlock. This was previously always locked because when I was doing the pre-order thing, it was just one of Captain Lockjaw's and one of Princess Amelie's. And I thought I was doing one of Princess Amelie's and that's why I was so surprised because the monolith didn't seem very princessy like at all, but I just kind of went with it. But it looks like, yeah, this is actually King Coaster's Royal Decree, which is locked until level five, which I currently am yet it's still locked. So I'm, I'm really confused. I don't know. I'm not going to question it. We're just going to move on. I'll probably come back to this guy at some point in time to get that third star, but right now I just can't really be bothered. We'll try out the Great Tree, which seems much, much more uh, fitting. And then we got a couple other scenarios there. If we go to Captain Lockjaw, there's the other guys, Creature Awakens and Pirate Cove. Nice. We'll, we'll head through and we'll do that. I don't know what the series is going to be if this is just me just like pounding out all the career and then heading into a sandbox, or I'll probably do a sandbox alongside of this at some point, and I'll just kind of slowly update that as time goes on. I don't know, does that, does that sound all right? We'll head into this though, and hopefully it's not super duper crazy, oh my god, annoying. Because that monolith one was, was pretty bad. They say this tree is the heart of the world. Can you respect Mother Nature and craft an eco-friendly theme park around the towering tree, or will you sell the woodland for profit and squeeze as much as you can from this verdant environment? Oh yeah. Ooh. Cool lighting. That must have taken fucking ages to do. Oh my god, I can't imagine. Which developer got stuck with that job? Oh, I'm so sorry. They fucked up a bit here. <laughs> Ugh, man. Alright. Achieve a scenery rating of 100. You know, it's quite unique because I think this is, uh, this is just terrain, right? Water? No. Yeah, it's just terrain. And then they use the terrain paint tool for... for all this. We'll just spam Control z for that. So it's really actually quite a unique idea. Using the terrain modifier tool to uh, create that. That's, that's nice. I like it. I'll read those in a moment. Just, uh, there we go. Nice. Gross, disgusting, dirty swamp water. A bit higher. Wait, really? How's that work? Ugh. Uh. Right. Control Z. Huh. Um. Can I use that? I could probably use that for a coaster or a track ride or something. So we'll leave it like that. That's fine. Although I do quite like the idea of having that really nasty swamp water because it, <laughs> A, it looks flooded and B, this bitch is like spraying out water. Oh no, it's just smoke. I don't know, it kind of fits. I mean, we've got like a Wicked Witch theme going on over here or something. So we'll, uh, we'll, we'll go with it. Listen to that music. This is not princess music. It's some witch spinning around holding a staff over her head. This nasty green fog. Green fog's the worst fog. It's raining down on people. This ride looks really lame. The exit's on the complete wrong side. <laughs> oh well. Okay, so what are we doing? Uh, scenery rating, of course, 100, then 120, ultimately 150. That's not that bad, I don't think. Park rating, 750, ultimately, that'll be a bit of a trick. Track rating will help a lot. Marketing rating, guest happiness will help a lot. And then build a coaster, 5 excitement, at most 5 nauseous, 5 seconds of time, that's fine. And monthly profit of 3,000, we're at probably only like 100. Alright, I, I can do that. I can certainly do that. I love the nice big thick path they got going on here. That's nice. Okay. So, first things first. Park management. Do we have any debts? I don't think so, because we're actually making money. No, no loans. Okay. Research. What do we got? 
A fast water track ride. Probably. A carousel. A thrill ride. Don't be afraid of heights. Not sure. Looney balloons. <gasps> Balloon shop. ATM. <laughs> and then tropical alpine grassland. Typical park. Art. Pirate theme. Planet coaster theme. Sci-fi theme. Western theme. And typical park scenery. I imagine we already have a fitting scenery for this place, so... Uh, we'll probably be, be okay holding off on scenery. This path extras, yeah, we got... Yeah, yeah, we got stuff. And in fact, I'll take advantage of this moment and do this real quick. How am I going to do food court? Because if I put down... Brain fart. Shops facilities, right? Wow. Ugh. God, those brain farts are getting bad, guys. I just... We'll just go village shop small. Because if I raise you up... You pathway like that. However... Wow, you, uh... You're really not happy there, are you? There. <laughs> Ugh. Awkward. Because if I do that... You're just kind of floating. And if I build you there, I don't know why that auto path isn't working, but if I build you there, I can't really... Can't really pathway for you. At all, to give you supports. Like, I can't just go... Support path, or anything like that, and if I go... Scenery, all scenery will just go, it's probably under building, but support, nothing there, building, all custom, support, uh, uh, uh. there we go, we got some, some, oops, I mean, I could, whoa. I mean, I guess? Doesn't look horrible. Undo. Whoops. <coughs> Did you see all those people just vanish just then? <laughs> he doesn't even care. He's just walking away, sipping his drink. They even together? I don't even know. Okay, so hmm, I could. I'd have to fashion with buildings, um, my own supports and all that, and make it look nice, which could definitely do. That'd be an off-camera thing for sure. But for now, we actually have this nice little area here. That I think I might just utilize, and we'll just make that the food court. So, we'll go ahead and do that. We can go naturopath, but that's probably fine. Yeah, we'll go with that. That's fine. And then widen it, widen it a bit. There we go. Can I do just... Can I do like food court, food court? S sort of. Just like fill it in with ground, you know? Looks like maybe no. All right, fine. I just want to have just pathway, you know, but the fucking road building is so disgusting. I hate it. Really hope they do something with that. 
Okay, so food plaza thing won't work. So I'll just have floating buildings for now and off camera at some point I will fill them in with something a bit more reasonable. So we've got standard drink shop. Fine. But I could have it. Sure is dark over here. Like pitch black dark. So like that, how'd you do that? Is that just a really thick road? Like disgustingly thick? Yeah, that's, that's all that is. That's just a really thick road. Well. Uh, actually. Yeah, how about that? Pat supports, definitely. Right? Might have to come out a little more. Will this work though? Hmm. No, obstructed. It does and it doesn't. And it's still goddamn floating. There, fix the railing. Alright, so I'll just do what I was going to do originally. And, uh... There you go, but one of you guys close. I don't need two open at once, that's expensive. So that is drinks fairy tale village hat shop sure and we'll just have to put up with them floating for now and then restrooms we got drink we need food Fairytale Village food kiosk. We'll go for the double food kiosk. We'll spin this around and we'll just throw it on this side. So that way you're sort of surrounded by buildings. It's more like a village that way. Mm, One of you guys are closed. In there. So now I got room to open them up later on. And restrooms. Are you the one with the restrooms on the back? No, okay, just the front. Good. Yeah, alright. I'm happy with it. It's sort of... Eh, in some places, like you're not... There we go. There, so it's somewhat level. All right, and I'll uh, I'll make them look good later, as I said. So that'll be that for now, and that should on its own get our scenery rating up there a bit more. Just those pre-made restaurants, restaurants, buildings. Nothing else I really think I need right now. I mean, ATMs and balloons at some point. Caribbean first aid station. Maybe at some point, because we got this over here, and I don't know what we're going to have going on. So I might throw one of these down. This will be where shit goes down, man, in the Wicked Witches area. Yeah. Yeah. Well, not really Wicked Witch. I don't... Kind of. I don't... Whatever that is. I don't know. <laughs> and then... Oh my god, I need... I need to hire people. Like, trash and stuff. Oh my god. Okay, pause everything.
quick before they start littering the place. I forgot. Scenery, path extras, we got... I'll go village heart bins. Village heart bin? Yeah, I guess. Heart of the village, maybe. Three there. Some nice music going on, sure. Three there. Ah, shit. Ah, God. Just... Just fix... Fix the path! Okay, there we go. It's a bit broken off over here, too. The hell? I have a lot of space to work with, so we could use that at some point. But for now, remove it, and there we go. Okay. Back to this. Good music, by the way. Damn good music. Very calming. And this seemed to work okay in the other scenario. With the uh, grouping of the trash bins, it, it, it's sort of my problem. It's like a nice in-between for more trash bins and giving the janitor enough time to get over there before it starts overflowing onto the uh, just pathway itself. So there, we got this. Links up. We'll throw... We'll throw some down here. Why not? And that dead ends. This loops around to this area. Oops. That was terrible. Okay. And then benches... I don't know. I mean, if I'm doing Thor Reds over here, I think I need benches for nausea and all that. But I don't know if it actually does anything other than that. Do people just, like, sit on them to eat? I think. It's pitch black right there, so I can't see. Eh, good enough. Okay, enough of that. That should be okay for now. And then hiring people... Research is almost done. Staff, we need a janitor here. He's already pissed off. Excellent. We'll get one over there. And then a mechanic. Throw you in the middle of nowhere. Okay. And if I take a look at staff... Janitors are just naturally pissy. Same thing with you guys, like... The fuck? 165. We'll just go 165 across the board. Because I feel like if they don't get much business, they just naturally get in a shitty mood just because they're bored. But the pay rise might help them stay happier. Alright, 15 buck raise across the board. Except the mechanic. He'll deal with it. It's already a lot of litter. It's already blowing up about the fucking litter. Research is ready. Balloons. Nice. And the ATM. Okay. And research, we have the information kiosk, which sells the priority passes, which could be good. I haven't messed around with those at all. It's a cheap research, so we may as well. Priority passes is the you spend like 40 bucks by default, I think it is, to buy a priority pass. And that allows you to skip the queue, I think. Something like that. Not, not, not entirely sure. But if I shops and facilities, we'll speed up time a bit here. Caribbean ATM Bank. Oh, we could throw that over here. This is where a lot of the rides are going to be. Oh, it's on the side. Oh, look at that. Shit. That's, that's, that's a very expensive thing for an ATM. But oh well. <laughs> Just feel like you could add on a couple more ATMs, you know. Maybe I could. If I go custom ATM. Just add it to the damn building. 
sort of. Think what I have to edit building with facilities ATM. Oh, you want to be on? Oh, way over there. Oh, there's another ATM in the back. Oh, what a piece. So we rotate you. Oh, that's so inconvenient. All right. Whoops. There you go. Undo that. I hate these shops that are like that. So we're just going to go standard ATM. I really do hate that. It's like, oh, yeah, you know, there's like three things on here, but they're in completely awkward locations. So you'll never really be able to put them down in any normal location. So you have to like fine tune everything to make it work. So there, we'll have a couple, couple ATMs down there. And then I could do a couple up here too. I'd really rather do it over here. Really wish you could just on the plat, on the uh, pathway. Get you somewhat level. There we go. All right. ATMs here and there. And then gift shop balloons. What do we got for balloons? Nothing. I have to make my own. Okay. Balloons were added after the fact. In a uh, somewhat recent update, balloons were added. So we'll have to see about making my own uh, balloon store. Just fine. Challenge accepted. We'll do that later on. Might have an unsaid video for all that. Not really sure. It depends what sort of demand there is. Let me know if that's something that would interest you. Just spending like an hour just doing shitty scenery and all that. I'm sure it's something nobody would actually watch. They would just have it on in the background for noise. But, uh, you know, that's fine. I can't pop your balloons. You're lucky. And since we have something there, we'll throw another bench. Here and here. Alright. Enough of that. So with that, we should be able to speed up time and be making a bit of money. A bit. I might extend the pathway a bit here. That's just one wide. Was it shift click? Yeah, that's that's the one. Four. Um. And then don't angle snap and length, and you figure out whoa the rest. No, just connect up to here. Oh, why are you making this so difficult? Why are you making this so difficult? What the hell? Just connect. There we go. So people down here have a way to get up to the food and all that faster. Although I might still do like restroom over here or something. We'll see. So am I actually making money right now? I don't even know. Since our rating is not fluctuating like hell, I could probably charge to come in. And no reason to stick around here. Can't believe the I can't believe the restroom's free. I can. It's like really? That's all right. The info kiosk. There you go. For the you can see about throwing that down too. For the priority pass that I may or may not actually use. There we go. And like this area alone might be enough. I think magic twirl is a great value. Yeah, I'd say so. I didn't adjust the sequence at all, so it probably takes forever to get going. So they're going to complain about the queue length at some point, but. 
Right. Yeah, that alone should be enough rating for at least bronze, I'd say. What do we got here? Cash flow, vertical lines, horizontal lines. How about just park rating? Oh, there we go. Eh, a bit. We needed how much? 100? 120? We're almost at 120 already. Yeah, that really won't be that bad. Once I get some supports down, that should give us another little boost. Uh, booth. Get this dressed up, should be nice. And then... Really, it'd just be a matter of getting rides that look decent. Where's the litter? Because I don't... I can't click you and you don't show me where the litter is. I have to find it myself. There really shouldn't be that much anywhere. I think once again you're complaining about imaginary litter. Game, there's no litter. There's a bit of litter. Oh, there's a lot of litter like right here. Okay. They just throw shit on the ground before leaving, I see. Good. Fucking savages. There. Uh, see that a bit better. There we go. And yeah, he's on the case. You're in an okay mood. Oh yeah. This job's great. Yeah, they love being busy. They love that shit. They get really ornery when there's nothing to do. So, side effect of hiring just a shitload of like mechanics or uh, janitors to get stuff done.